Jared Eichhoff's with us. Two innings, two strikeouts. Baseball's back. Jared, welcome back, pal. How are you? Yeah, thanks. I'm good. How you doing? Uh, we're doing good. It was probably nice to uh, get that ball for the first time today and, uh, you know, gear up and get ready for the season, getting that first, uh, you know, couple innings under your belt. Yeah, yeah. It's been uh, it's been an exciting time just in camp in general. And uh, just to get back on the mound just felt uh, felt pretty, pretty good. Uh, difference in the camp so far, Gabe and Pete, I mean, two different guys. It seems that everything's a lot different down there. Is it as different as it is being portrayed? I, I think it is. Uh, it, it's the contrast is pretty is pretty crazy, or has been pretty crazy. Um, whether it's just the music or just the staff in general, um, the positivity and is, is off the charts, and um, just the vibes in the clubhouse on the field, and is little stuff during the stretches, and it's just uh, it's just a it's a really fun time, really exciting time. Jared Eichhoff's with us. Uh, Jared, I think most people pencil you in as a guy who's an innings eater, a part of that rotation. But how much competition uh, is there at camp for those five spots in the rotation? Uh, I think right now there's there's quite a bit. Um, you know, especially having you know, not having a uh, a free agent sign at all. It's just it's just us guys that are in the organization here, and uh, you know, we're I think we're all putting their best foot forward and trying to just compete and. Um, I think it, that's going to breed uh, breed the best results. Jared Eichhoff, two innings, two strikeouts uh, for the Phils. You know, and then you look around. You got Nola and yourself, two guys who have been there. Vince has been uh, injured a lot, but uh, obviously you got a lot of young guys competing for those spots. But the other part of this team that should be interesting is you got a lot of young guys all over the offensive side of the diamond. So it looks like the offense is filled with a lot of young bats as well. Absolutely. Um, we got a lot of really just really good athletes in general. Uh, you know, spread it outfield, infield, uh, guys with with an exceptional amount of speed. Um, it, it's going to be pretty exciting. Whether it's stealing bags or getting to a ball uh, into the gap, hopefully not too often. Uh, but uh, tracking balls down and all that. But it, it's going to be uh, it's going to be a pretty pretty fun team to watch. I think. Jared, you talked a little bit about the excitement and the attitude around camp. Uh... I guess for Phillies fans out there too, there's excitement because w- would you agree that this is the first time that in the last couple of years the team's going into camp not like total long shot? I mean, uh, there, there's a real chance here when you look at the rest of the division and the teams that are out there that this team could make some noise. Yeah, absolutely. We're uh, as, as a team, as uh, as an individual, as a coaching staff, as an organization. I think we're we're very excited. We're uh, you know we got the head to the grindstone here. We're uh, we we have high expectations, and whether that's the same, uh, you know, outside looking in, I think we're we're expecting to do some uh, exciting things and and maybe shock some people. Uh, but it's uh, you know, like I said, it, it's going to be an exciting time, and we're we're very very much looking forward to getting getting things going. How about you between last season and this season? Of course, when you come in, uh, you had that eleven and fourteen season a couple seasons ago and a three point six five ERA last season. The numbers maybe not where you want them to be. Well, what's your off season been like, and what have you done to sort of get closer to those better numbers? Yeah, so uh, it's been a, a relatively normal off season. Uh, you know, just resting the arm a little bit. You know, as far as the nerve nerve issue went, but I, you know, I think I'm back on the right track there. And tweaked a couple things as far as mechanics go. And uh, you know, I think coaches and and players have had some good feedback uh, for me. You know, post post bullpen, post live BPs. And uh, so that's been really uh, a really good experience there. And obviously get, get back out there today in the, in the stadium there was another uh, kind of a check off the list. Uh, so yeah, it, it's, uh, it's, it's going to be, it's going to be an exciting time. We're uh, I think I ironed some stuff out and I think we're uh, going to be full steam ahead here. Did you like that the other day? And here's another example of Gabe Kapler outside the box when the umpires were there in the bullpen session. Yeah, yeah, I was uh, I was actually looking forward to it. I didn't know what to what to think at first, but they were, uh, you know, they were they were hollering hollering strike one, and yeah. um, I think you could hear them from uh, from the outfield of of uh, 
of uh, Carlton Field. So they were they were letting letting it eat out there behind the behind the plate, letting <laughs> you know. Uh, Jared Eichhoff, perfect for two innings today as uh, Phillies uh, pick up their first uh, you know real action today against the University of Tampa. That's that uh, game they play every year. Six nothing. Uh, he missed the final month of last year with that nerve irritation in his throwing hand. Uh, everything uh, a okay? It seems like then from that uh, you know you know a little set uh, setback. Yeah, it's been good. Uh, everything's been feeling great. Uh, and just trying to keep that same, that same, uh, same vibe every day, and just working on it, making sure I'm trying to stay healthy, maintain the, the mechanical part of things, staying strong, and uh, you know, being healthy. That's that's priority number one. Okay, uh, good to be back on the mound. Good to have baseball back. A good feeling, good vibe. Jared Eichhoff, everybody, kind enough to give us a quick call after their game today down there. Uh, in Clearwater as the Phillies beat Tampa 6 nothing. Jared, appreciate it uh, for the quick time. Absolutely. Happy to do it, guys. Have a good one.